come out of there. Looks like some kind of snake. Let's see if it works. What's going on everybody and welcome. We're actually uh, all loaded up here in Felix and we're gonna head to a Nautic Star that is in Tampa. So, the sun's right in my face. Anyway, let's uh, get the show on the road and I'll see you there. Well, here she is. I'm not sure what model this is. It looks like a little 21 footer maybe. It's kind of like a deck boat. Pretty cool. This is a cool spot too. This is the Hillsborough River. Nice and quiet back here. No, I see. It's a 203. I was close, so 20 foot. All right, well, let's jump on. The stereo doesn't work, so we need to figure out why. Well, she's a little dusty from the trees and stuff around us here, but in good shape. Just needs a hose. She'll clean up. Doesn't look like anything stained here. Let's turn her batteries on. She has a master power at her dash. Yep. Right above it is our infinity. So you just be able to push power. Accessory or anything? Nope. This is just builds, dock lights, courtesy nav, so there's nothing here to turn it on. Unless you have to turn the key switch on, so we can try that. Get in there. There we go. Nothing, nothing. Okay. Well, I'm not sure where, but let's look in here for fuses. I'm gonna watch out for spider webs too. If you can see it in the camera, I look a little bit. Oh, well, you're gonna be able to see in the dark. Oh, you can see it. There's our fuse panel. And they're all labeled, so let me look. You can find the fuse and get in this hole here. That might be the whole problem here is the fuse being blown. Let's hope. You can't see it in the camera, but it is blown for sure. So I'm gonna rob a fuse next to it and put it in. See what it does. Oh, let's just blow that fuse. It don't look like it. Let's try it again. See if it turns on now. There we go. Okay, good. We got good stereo power now, but I just put the balance all the way over to the right side, and our speaker right here is not working. What the? front right one is both of these speakers work too out of all of them so let me go get a screwdriver and some fuses we'll pull that speaker make sure it's plugged in or if there's something wrong connection wise or something all right let's get this speaker out huh that's hilarious I just put my drill on this and now it's working so I'm gonna pull it off because Sounds like I just made the connection happen because it rattled or something. So, there's something going on here. Let's pull it all the way out. Well, our connections look good and solid. Maybe the speaker's going out or something. One of these little connections right here. So, we'll put it back in. See if it works, and we'll know if it uh, fails in the future. Need a new speaker because our connections are fine, and these lead right to the back of the stereo. I checked all that when I was looking at the fuses and the wiring to make sure. So let's see if she jams now. Turn our volume up. Including pool parties with world-renowned artists, with a variety of gaming, dining, and entertainment options. Can... All right, good. She's working. We leave that alone. I'll put the rest of the screws in it. And we'll check uh, all of our other components real quick, make sure everything's working. Right, we'll turn it back up, make sure all the speakers are working. Good. Good. Yep, they're all good. You can hear it. So that's fixed, we'll turn that off. Let's see, we don't have an accessory, nothing lights up here. Let's see if we can hear our bilge. Here, running below us here. I'm sure, it's gonna be in this hole back there. Let's see if it has dock lights. 
Yep. Got lights up front. You got courtesy lights, let's see. Yep, got blue lights there. There's one back here. We can check our nav lights. It's important. Our anchor lights working. Also got us a Yamaha 150 here. There are our nav lights right here. That's working. And we got green. Well, that's good news. Everything's working. I don't have to mess with anything else except for the horn, maybe. Uh, oh, it works. And our switch off. Oh, wait, hang on. Let's check our Simrad. I think I seen it light up earlier. Yeah. She's on. We turn our key on. We only got 39 hours on her. And I haven't broke in yet. All right, we can turn this off. Pull the key. Yeah, that's a pretty cool little boat. Honestly, we uh, we just stopped selling these Nautic Stars. I'm not sure exactly why, but my guess is they're very similar to a Sea Ray. So, why sell two of the same kind of boat? This is a perfect boat for this area, though. You got the river here. Get in and out. Put some people on it. Enjoy your day. You got your little sink here, a cooler spot. You got, of course, you're going to have stereo now. We got a table back here. You got Mr. Reliable here. You got stairs on the front and the back of this. I'm not sure what's up here. Oh, I see that. This is for a seat for fishing up here. Cool idea, too. You can sit right up here and cast. Then below us, we got some storage here, storage underneath everything. Like I said, this is dirty. Sorry. Usually these boats are cleaner, but it looks like they're living in the jungle here. So, all the wind blows and it gets all that tree crap on everything. Well, this is a simple fix and I'm glad because the stereo was bad or a battery was bad or something. I'd have to drive all the way back out here and it's easily a little over an hour drive. So, all good. Everything works. I checked the components. The only thing I didn't do is fire the Yamaha, but we got power. Everything's there. I'm not really worried about that. They would have complained if they had a problem with that Yamaha. So, we're good. I'm going to head back to the shop here and uh, as always... I appreciate everybody watching. I will see you next time. Later. Well, this is kind of strange. We're going over the bridge here and you can't see anything. It's just fog over the water. The bridge is right in front of us. Can't even barely see the sign here. Can't see the water at all. Port of Tampa.